And when you come into Thomas Good, it's an experience. You have probably the biggest selection of china and glass anywhere. The history brings most of the clients in. Once they get in here, they love the shop. And we had the Minton Elephants, which were made in 1889 for the Universal Trade Fair. It was the year that Eiffel Tower was open to the public. And we started off in near Hanover Square, and we moved to the present site in 1845. We have one of the first automatic doors, all done by weight, so it's lovely. You stand on a mat, it'll open for you. Been here 58 years, so seen a lot of comings and goings. I would say if you come to Thomas Goods, it's an experience in itself. I've packed things from chandeliers down to teacups, works of art. Um, we've actually got sheep in the shop and camels and polar bears, but they've all been packed one way or another. The shop staff, if you like, are on the front line. I'm downstairs. Well, when I first started here, there was an old boy, uh, Sid Baker, said to me, just treat the china like you do indoors. Forget the price, because as soon as you start thinking about the price, you will start shaking, or you think, hang about, I've got about 20,000 pound in my hand. Don't think about the price. And it's worked. It's an old building. It's, you still walk around, and all of a sudden you see something you've never seen before. And a staircase that goes up and stops. So what's behind that, I do not know. It could be some old members of staff. I don't think many people now stay at a job more than 10 years, do they? Maybe it's because it's a one-off company and they treat us well. They've always done, uh, from when Peter Good had it to where we are now. Uh, this is our safe, and again, probably been here 150 years, and uh, this is where we keep all the bespoke and the lovely crested plates and glass, and, and you can smell when you come here the history in here. The Queen of Doll's House was made for the, the Queen Mother, and as you can see, all to size, a little small, all miniature, but all the pieces there. I love this one, look. It's still got his name on. Mr. Good. <laughs> Long may this room always stay here. This is what it's all about. And this is why when you say the staff love the history, the clients love it. We have a beautiful book here that the Thomas Goods went round Russia in 1878. And this is all handwritten. Look at this one for the, all the old designs and patterns. Now look, look at the work in that. He loved Japan. One of our, uh, the Good family built a Japanese garden and it's still um, going now, today. Probably down here is one of my favorite parts of the bit, in the business, down in the archives. Because down here, you're going back in time. You're actually going back to a different era. Thank you.